Hello, my dear friends. Myself, Mr. B. G. Kolapa, Assistant Professor, Department of Chemistry, Sri Ramuka Devi, ACS Mahavidyalaya Maha. So, students, today we will learn about the borings, repetition of borings, properties of borings, and structure of diborane. So, students, do you know what are borings? Borings are the binary compounds of boron with hydrogen are called boron hydrides and boranes are these hydrides of boron are called boranes these hydrides can be divided into several series like bnhn plus 4 called neuro neuroborane such as in that examples are b 6 called diborane b 5 h 9 called pentaborane b 6 h 10 b 8 h 12 b 10 h 14 and BNHN plus 6 called arachnoborin. In that examples are B4H10, B5H9, B6H10, B8H40 and B9H15. So students, now we see the repression of borines. Repression of borines by reduction of boron trifluoride with rate with lithium aluminum hydride in thiethyl ether. When two when four molecules of BF3 are combined with ether molecule with three molecules of lithium aluminum hydride to form two molecules of diborane with three molecules of lithium fluoride and three molecules of aluminum trifluoride and four molecules of ether and uh, diborane is prepared in the laboratory by the oxidation of sodium borohydride with iodine in the diaglime as a solvent when NaBH4 reacts with I2 to form diborane with 6 molecule of NaO on the industrial scale diborane is obtained by reduction of BF3 with sodium hydride like BF3 plus 6 molecule of sodium hydride and formation of diborane with 6 molecules of NaF preparation of higher boranes. Higher boranes are obtained when P2H6 is heated at 373 to 5 to 3 degree Kelvin. Now we see the properties of borings or diborane. Physical state diborane is a colorless, highly toxic gas. Boiling point is about 180 degree Kelvin. Stability of diborane diborane is stable only at low temperature, and diborane is heated in sealed between 373 degree to 573 degree Kelvin. A complex reaction occurs and Various higher borings are get um, when diborane at 373 or at uh, higher or at in between uh, 3 degree Kelvin to form different borings like B4H10, B5H11, B6H12. But careful control of temperature, pressure, and reaction time different individual borings can be obtained like when di diborane two molecules then formation of B4H. Then plus H2 with the stable borane or individual borane scheme will be formed. Now combustibility, it catches fire spontaneously upon exposure to air and it gets reacts with air. It burns in oxygen involving an enormous amount of heat when diborane is reacts with three molecules of oxygen in formation of B2O3 plus three molecules of H2 with evolution of heat minus 1976 kJ per mole like diborines, hyperborines, spontaneously burst in air also, hydrolysis. Hydrolysis borines are readily hydrolyzed by water to form boric acid like b 6 reacts with 6 molecules of water molecules, then formation of 2 molecules of boric acid with evolution of H2 molecule with methanol also and trimethyl borate is formed when diborine reacts with 6 molecules of methanol to form Try methyl borate with the evolution of hydrogen molecules. Reaction with Lewis bases, cleavage reaction. Lewis bases reactions are also called as cleavage reaction. Diborane on treatment with Lewis bases first undergoes cleavage to form a borane, which then reacts with Lewis bases to form adducts like B2H6 plus 2 NME3 is the base methyl trimethylamine and then formation of 2BH3 with NME3 B2H6 plus 2CO is the base 
कार्बन मोनोक्साइड टू फॉर्म टू बी एच थ्री सी ओ मोलिक्यूल नेक्स्ट लाइफ वी सी हियर रिएक्शन विथ अमोनिया अमोनिया डायबोरिन कंबाइंस विथ अमोनिया टू फॉर्म एन एडिशन प्रोडक्ट लाइक बी टू एच सिक्स टू एन एच थ्री फॉर्मुलेटेड एज बी एच टू एन एच थ्री बाई टू बी एच फोर माइनस विच वेन हिटेड टू फोर सेवन थ्री डी वी के लिए डिकम्पोज टू यू ए वोलाटाइल कंपाउंड कॉल बोरेजिन और बोरेज वेन थ्री मॉलिक्यूल्स ऑफ बी टू एच सिक्स इज रिएक्ट विथ सिक्स मॉलिक्यूल ऑफ एन एच थ्री देन फॉर्मेशन ऑफ टू थ्राइस बी एच टू एन एच थ्री बाई टू प्लस बी एच फोर माइनस देन अगेन इट गेट रिएक्ट देन फॉर्मेशन ऑफ बोरेजिन प्राइस बी थ्री एन थ्री एच सिक्स प्लस ट्वेल्व एच टू मॉलिक्यूल बोरेजिन इज आइसो इलेक्ट्रॉनिक एंड आइसो स्टेरिक विथ बेंजिन एंड इट्स स्ट्रक्चर इज सिमिलर टू दैट ऑफ बेंजिन एक्सपेक्ट दैट इन बेंजिन द पा इलेक्ट्रॉन्स आर कंप्लीटली डिलोकलाइज बट इन बोरेजिन दे आर ओनली पार्शियली डिलोकलाइज बिकॉज ऑफ इट्स सिमिलेरिटी विथ बेंजिन बोरेजिन इज ऑल्सो कॉल एज इन ऑर्गेनिक बेंजिन सो दिस इज बोरेजिन मॉलिकुल ऑफ बोरेजिन विथ डिलोकलाइज ऑफ पा इलेक्ट्रॉन क्लाउ then formation of complex borohydride several metal hydrides react with diborane to form tetrahydro hydrido borates known as borohydride all these contain the tetrahedral bh4 minus ion this is the tetrahedral bh4 minus ion like when nh means sodium borohydride sodium hydride is reacts with diborane then formation of na bh4 two molecules of na bh4 and when 2 lih means lithium hydride is reacts with diborane then formation of lithium borohydride means twice two molecules of li bh4 and bh4 is in tetrahedral unit both sodium borohydride and lithium borohydrides are used as reducing agent in different organic synthesis they also serve as starting material for many other borohydrides like we see next reaction with alkalis diborane dissolves in strong alkali to produce meta borates and dihydrogen gas between six it reacts with koh two molecules of koh then for again react with two molecules of h2 then formation of two molecules of kbu2 plus six molecules with evolution of gas h2 molecule action of halogen acids diborane reacts with halogen acids to give Hello, diborane is evolving H2 gas. The reactivity of halogen acids, although the order like HI is more reactive towards the diborane, does the HI react at about 3 to 3 degree Kelvin in absence of catalyst, while HBr and HCl reacts in presence of their aluminium halide as a catalyst. Like B2H6 HI, then formation of B2H5 I plus evolution of H2 molecule, and B2H6 is reacts with HBr and it's still simultaneously but hbr and hcl requires the catalyst but ha cannot here action of halogen halogen also reacts with diborane to form the corresponding halo diborane so the activity decreases in all the cl2 br2 and i2 the cl2 reacts explosively at room temperature but reacts br2 reacts rapidly at 373 degree kelvin by while i2 reacts slowly at 3 it is explosively at 373 degree kelvin so it also appears chemically reactively in this reaction so borohydride or diborane is used for preparing number of the molecules which i told lithium borohydride and bh4 it is used as reducing agent for organic synthesis फॉर्मुला ethyl molecule having molecular formula c2h6 this is the structure of ethyl molecule with and this is the also three dimensional structure of diborane and three dimensional structure of 
ethane molecule now in diborane each boron atom has three valence electrons for sharing if we assume that each boron forms three covalent bonds with three hydrogen atoms then there are no electrons left with boron atom or sharing with other boron atom therefore Hydrogens. These are the terminal hydrogens in thick line and in rigid lines. These four terminal hydrogens and the two boron atoms lie in the same plane, while the remaining two hydrogen atoms, one lying above and one lying below this plane, form bridges and hence are called the bridged hydrogen atom. So this is the bridged hydrogen atom and having above and below the plane of that BH BH2 units and hence this atom or this hydrogen is called as the bridged hydrogen atoms and these hydrogens are the terminal hydrogen atoms and also these atoms are also terminal hydrogen atoms. There are two types of bonding or there are two types of hydrogen atoms present in diborane. One is the bridged and one is the terminal hydrogen atom. So this is the next three dimensional structure of diborane. 1, 2 boron atoms and 6 hydrogens, hydrogen atoms are there. Now we see here types of bonds in diaborin. How much types of bonds are present in diaborin? The 4 terminal BH bonds are normal. So the 4 terminal BH bonds are normal covalent bonds. In covalent bonds there are 2 electron covalent bond forms by sharing and pairing the electrons like these BH bonds are normal covalent bonds and hence are quite strong as compared to the bridged hydrogen bonds each bonds now we see here each bond is formed by sharing a pair of electron between boron and hydrogen and hence are also called two center electron pair bonds or two center two electron bond 2C2E this is the terminal hydrogen bonds two center B and H B and H there are in that one single covalent bond having two electron with two center B and H now we see the two bridged bonds that is B H B are quite different from normal covalent bonds each bridge hydrogen is bonded to two boron atoms by a pair of electrons these are three central electron pair bonds or three central two electron bond and hence are quite weak as compared to the as compared to the pH terminal bond. So this is the boron atom, two boron atoms having one boron atom having three electrons that two electrons are shared with two hydrogen atoms and having remaining one electron is shared with hydro, one hydrogen and one boron atom means two boron atoms share and one hydrogen atom sharing two electrons in between them like this is also same as compared to the above this is the diaborin structure these are the terminal BH terminal and two are the bridged hydrogen having three atom sharing two electrons two boron and one hydrogen atoms so this bond is the three center two electron bond like this here you can see here four bonds are two center two electron and two are the three center two electron bonds or bridged hydrogens are having two and terminal BH having four hydrogen are the terminal atom and we can see here banana bond shape of diaborin in that diaborin are also having the banana the banana bond shape because of their resemblance to banana these three central electron pair bonds are also called banana bond 
so like this these bridged bonds are also bridged hydrogen or the two, two center three center two electron bonds are also called the banana bond now we see here structure of dibrane on the basis of hybridization the boron atom in the excited state is 1s2 2s1 2px1 2py1 and 2pz0 it undergoes gsp3 hybridization to form sp3 hybridization like this four sp3 hybrid orbitals of two boron atoms having one electron in each orbital to form a dibrane molecule these are the four sp3 hybrid orbitals the two half filled hybrid orbitals of each boron atom overlap with the half filled orbitals of hydrogen atom to form a normal covalent bonds whereas the third half filled or hybrid orbital of one boron atom and the vacant hybrid orbital of the second boron atoms overlap simultaneously with the half filled orbitals of hydrogen atom the electron cloud contains only two electrons but spread over three atoms that is why this bond is called three center electron pair bond because of the shape of the electron cloud form it is called banana bond and molecules like b2a6 which do not have sufficient number of electrons to form normal covalent bonds are called electron deficient compounds hence the diborenes or some herborenes are also called as electron deficient compounds so this is the structure an electron configuration of boron in excited state is 2s sp3 sp3 hybridization okay, students thank you